Alright, so blue steel. So steel is always a little bit difficult just because um, they have a, a good amount of removal. Um, I'll keep these. Befuddle is always good. Just to probably protect the Maleficent here. We are going second, which is a little bit of a disadvantage um, for aggro decks usually. But it does depend on their turn one. Okay, their turn one was a little bit empty, so I feel pretty safe to just play Maleficent here. No turn two, okay. That's kind of interesting. Um, so let's get rid of this guy. We'll just keep putting out our um, high lore cards. Try to create an early advantage. No turn two, okay. Um, how do I want to do this? This for sure goes down, um... Yeah, let's get rid of LeFou, I think. Or do I get rid of the Madame Mim? I might still want to keep a um, Befuddle. Definitely want to play two Pascals here, I'm just not sure what to ink. I guess we'll ink the Madame Mim here. And if you can't answer this board, you should be in a lot of trouble. An empty here, I'm... Oof, that's so unfortunate. Um, yeah, so let's use LeFou on Pinocchio. And... Should be. I don't think I have a reason to play this Maleficent. If he has grab your swords, then um, he'll wipe my board anyway. So I'll just hold on to the Maleficent. Okay, he didn't have grab your swords. That was very unfortunate for him. I think he got a very slow hand. Or he didn't think I would be aggro. Okay, another steal. This time with green. Um... Let's see, so I don't want this guy. Don't want sorcerers. This is a bit slow. I think I even get rid of the mini mouse. Okay. I'll probably ink one of the Madame Mims here. Going second. We'll see if this is a a tempo deck I'm up against. Interesting card. Okay. Fair enough. Um so we'll get rid of one of the meta mims. Gonna put him left sit down. He's not gonna quest. I feel like that's a mistake. Like I guess he's afraid of the Maleficent here. But um I mean I'm happy to quest. Uh let's see. I don't think he would play any rush minions, so I think I can ink here. Probably just play a Cusco. Wow, 
wow, he plays the 6 mana Robin Hood. It's kind of interesting. Okay. Uh, let's see. So I can just crash the Kuzco into that. Do I really want to, though? Let's ink here. I'm 100% playing Arthur. The question is whether I just I punch Cusco or do I um do I race? Because I'm thinking of what I would discard. Maybe I'll discard one of the Lafus. Lafus a very strong card though. Maybe um maybe the Madam Mim. No, let's get rid of one of the Lafus. It's fine. He'll draw a card with his prince. I just want to slow him down just a little bit. Okay, Ursula. Alright, um, let's see. So we'll quest here. Quest with Arthur. Bounce back the Maleficent. Then we'll use LeFou to unexert Arthur. We'll quest with this. Replay the Maleficent. And what do I ink? Do I ink Cusco? I don't think I'll get much of an opportunity with Queen of Hearts, but I might still want to punch with her. Let's sink her. It's fine. I can simply outrace him if he doesn't have enough removal here. Sudden chill. Okay. He just plans on erasing my hand. He has hand advantage, but I'm kind of okay with that. Okay. Oh, he runs Pete. That's kind of interesting. Um, Befuddle. Can Befuddle the, the Chris Merfolk? Anyway, um, we'll quest here, quest here. We'll do the same thing. And we'll quest here. Um, can punch with Cusco again. Mm, well, because these guys have... Um, I wouldn't have anything to befuddle anyway, so... May as well just befuddle this. Um... I can befuddle my own Maleficent, even. What if I befuddle my own Maleficent, replay her? Kind of like that, actually. And then Cusco can probably just punch the Merfolk. And that's it. I don't think he recovers from this, unless he does something crazy with Pete. No, it's just a... Ooh, Tinkerbell's pretty huge, actually. Alright, these two will... Um, I really just need these two. Yeah, he's just playing Sudden Chill. I don't think he has anything left. This is going to be one, two, and then the other two lower from Arthur's effect. Should be GG. Interesting Pete, though. 
Yeah, GG. Okay. Do kind of want to keep the Arthur. Ooh, I want to keep the Arthur Lufu combo. That's always super good. Um, maybe I keep all of this. I'll keep all of this. Probably ink the Minnie Mouse. So, yeah. So I'll start by inking the Minnie Mouse, play a Pascal. And I guess I'll go from there. I'll decide if I want to ink the Befuddle later or use it to protect the Pinocchio. Aggro decks. Um, well, I think I ink here and then just play a Pinocchio. If he quests with the Maleficent, I'll probably trade my Pascal into it. Assuming she doesn't get bounced back or unexerted. Okay, Ursula. Flynn Rider, huh? Okay. Um, alright. Befuddle might be good here. So I am gonna make this trade. Mm. No, I think I still go for the Arthur. I'm gonna wait on the, um, before questing with Pinocchio. I'm gonna wait, um, then next turn what I'm gonna do is I'll quest with Pinocchio, assuming he's still alive. And then I'll quest with Arthur to bounce back the Pinocchio. Okay, he did have Cloud Kicker. That's a little bit bad for me. Um, because I do have to replay the Arthur. Slows me down a lot. Let's befuddle the Flynn Rider here. Okay. Prince John, so he plans on discarding my hand. It's kind of interesting, so it's not exactly like a... It's not exactly a... Um, a discard deck. But it's kind of like a discard tempo deck. Hmm. Do I replay Arthur again? Yeah, I think so. This time I can quest with Pin Pinocchio, though. Because I can ink here. I can quest. I can unexert him. And then I can play Arthur. Sudden chill. He did successfully slow me down a lot, so um, we'll see if he can answer this, though. I think the way to answer this for him would be to bounce back one of these guys and then use Sudden Chill. He's going to quest with the Prince John. It's kind of interesting. Um, alright. So I could punch LeFou into the Prince John. And then have Arthur quest. Hmm. Because I could also Queen of Hearts this. The question is whether I want to Queen of Hearts the Kid Cloud Kicker. I mean, I don't think he's that scary. So, let's just quest normally here. We'll 
quest with the Pinocchio. with the Maleficent. Interesting. So... Hmm. I need to draw an Inkable here. Okay, I did. That's good. Um, LeFou punches the Maleficent. Slows him down a little bit. with everything. Probably my Merlin will hit the um, Enchantress here. Because I don't quite have enough for lethal, I don't think. He has what? He has two, three, four, five, six, and then eight with this. So I do have to kill that Enchantress. Yeah. Maybe I, if I hadn't, uh, maybe if I had quested with the Lufu last turn, it would have been correct. I should have thought I had. Anyway, um, this for sure punches here. Okay, it's not quite what I needed. Alright, let's play Merlin Rabbit. There's Madame Mim. Do I ink the Madame Mim? Or do I ink friends? Let's ink Madame Mim. Alright, let's see if he finds an answer. Alright, he did not. GG. Okay, uh, I go second. Alright, I don't want Merlins. Um, Madame Mim. Do I want Madame Mim? I might still want her, so let's keep this. Okay. Don't think I'll want two Madam Mims though, so I'll just do this. Bernard, interesting. Minnie Mouse. He's a singer three. Hmm, that's the first time I've seen this card. Um, ink Pascal and then unexert the Maleficent so that she doesn't die to the Minnie Mouse. Singer. Okay, there's another singer. Um, do I quest with LeFou and then use Madame Mim to kill that Minnie Mouse? I don't know if that's correct. Maybe I just play my 
my Minnie Mouse Surfer. Because Ariel can, can sing anyway. So I do have to play aggro here. This is going to be a, a tough one though, because it's um, Ember Steel. Ember Steel is always kind of tough. Yeah, there's Strength of a Raging Fire. Punch into the aerial. Yeah. It is. Yeah, it's bad for my curve, but I feel like I gotta do it. Hmm. I'll even include the LeFou. This could be a misplay, but, um... Don't know what else I can do. Because I didn't exactly pick up in, on, uh... A lot of my high, um... High lore character cards. I just had the Maleficent. So... I think I do this. Ink this LeFou. And play Cusco. Yeah. surfer. Eliminating Ariel is quite good, though. I don't think he would make this trade. Oh, he does make the trade, okay. Okay. Um... Alright, let's play this Merlin. Um... Hmm, let's see. I think I ink this Befuddle. And then just play the Sorcerers. Reason being is that, um... He might play a, a whole new world. So I don't want to have too big of a hand. Yeah. He does have to hard cast it, though. I think I'd befuddle the Minnie Mouse. Yeah, let's befuddle this Minnie Mouse. Um, friends? Do I sing friends? I think so. It's better than questing for one. And we'll play this. We'll play this. We'll play the Arthur. Then we'll ink one of the Madame Mims. And we'll quest with the, uh, the Spellbook. Tinkerbell was uh, quite big. Alright, so we'll quest here. I will quest with Arthur. Bounce back the Merlin. Hmm. 
can use Madam Mim to bounce back the Arthur. So he doesn't get killed. Might be worth it. I do miss out on a on one with the spellbook. I think it's better. Okay. It does banish my item. Alright, so how do I want to do this? Well, he does have a... Then along came Seuss. On the Merlin, not the Arthur. It's kind of interesting. Oh, okay, he's gonna do that on the Arthur. Okay, not bad. Um... I think I play Arthur here. I don't think I quest with the Madam Mim because I don't want Tinkerbell to um, punch into her. Unless I want to punch into this uh, mini mouse. Hmm. Ink the Cusco to play the Merlin. Yeah, I should have played the Merlin first actually. Um, let's see. Do I use Madame Mim to hit the Minnie Mouse? Because then... Then this Tinkerbell can hit here. And then deal two to one of my characters. And I don't know if I want that. But this Minnie Mouse can sing. I think I'm more scared of the Tinkerbell doing something. So yeah, let's just pass. So what do I got here? So I got one, two, three, two, one, two, three, four, five. Oh, I win. Yeah, that's GG. That was a fun match. Right. Okay, so blue purple, um keep this guy. Get rid of the I think get rid of everything else. Yeah, I think I get rid of everything else. Get a turn one, unfortunately. We're gonna ink a Merlin Goat. It's a poor start for me. I'm going second. Did not have a one cost. Uh, we'll ink a Madame Mim. Has to be Pinocchio. Oof, that's a very good Pinocchio. That's a very, very good Pinocchio. That is why you tech this card. It's good against aggro. Good against Agro, good against those um, those Ursulas. A little unfortunate that it can't be inked, but um, still a very good card. Okay. Hmm. 
Interesting. Um, okay. Not completely against that. Um, Alright, let's see. I think I can ink this Merlin? No, let's ink the friends. Ink the friends, play the Arthur and the Cusco. have Cusco punch into the Pinocchio. There's a chance he might bounce back the Pinocchio, and I don't want him getting use of that that effect anymore. Um, let's see. Can LeFou to protect... No. I think I simply quest with Arthur. Bounce back the Cusco. So the plan is to do the LeFou Arthur combo. I'll use Madame M to bounce back the Pinocchio, I think. So let's start with this. Then we'll quest here. Madam Mim. Bounce this back. Replay it. Um, does Cusco quest? Yeah, he quests. And I don't think I ink Pascal. I think I just keep him in my hand. Crella Deville does beat the Pascals. Interesting. He did not have any items. It's kind of unlucky for him. Does need some way to deal with this, though. Alright, so I got three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I'm off by one. play everything, right? I think blue-purple really has anything that um, wipes the board. I'm feeling pretty safe to just play everything. He's only going to be at 17 if he quests. Okay, Amber Ruby. I do like keeping the Arthur. Don't want this. There's too many Madame Mims. I don't want Pongo. Um, I don't even want this Madame Mim. Yeah, we'll actually keep just an Arthur and a Madame Mim snake. Okay. No turn one. It's a little unfortunate. be a little trouble because this might be a 
I was thinking this might be an aggro deck. Okay, yeah, it's not aggro. Okay, he's gonna get rid of my befuddle. That's fine. Um, ink this Madam Mim, or ink the snakes. I think we'll, I think I'll just ink one of the snakes. playing this. Let's take the other snake. We'll play Pascal. There we go. And we'll see what comes out of Duck, because, uh... Maybe I should have inked the... I was thinking that I might want to rush into Duck. But maybe I wanted to snake the this Arthur. So I could so I could replay him next turn. That's fine. Okay, there's Mufasa. Mm. What do I want to do here? I think I quest 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 here. Bounce back the Pascal. And then have Madam Mim crash into the dock. Yeah. So Mufasa will punch into the Madam Mim. about Prince Eric is that unless he has teeth and ambitions, he won't have a way to kill him. So he actually needs teeth and ambitions here. Um, anyway. Hold his quest with everything. This is going to be very scary for him. Medusa kills Arthur. Can he sing Teeth and Ambitions? He's gonna have to sing Teeth and Ambitions. Yeah, he doesn't have it. Alright, GG.